Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. My name is Park, and in today's video we're going to start working on a new build, a slap lance. As always, if you want to skip what the build is, you can skip to what the time on screen is. Alright, so this is our set for now. I'm using the Camellios gun lance because it came out slightly ahead of the Gold Rathian one in the Sims that I did. Even though it's a bit weird, I guess the 4 slot puts it ahead of it because we can get more mastery and stuff into this build. Obviously the shelling doesn't matter too much because it's a slap lance, we're not going to be using it too much. Um, we've got this augmented already because I did not upgrade that armor piece and I don't have the spheres for it because my game crashed. So I'd have to go farm spheres again, but I don't want to do that. Talisman's the basic one that I have, just a five point talisman should be fine. And here's all our skills. There's a lot in this build to be honest. I'm just gonna probably play pretty terribly because uh, I'm fairly reliant on uh, burst fires in this game at least. And I think today we're gonna take on the 139 Garangom. He's got some good hit zones, he's a big lad so we should be able to dodge him pretty easily. So it'll be a nice test. Alrighty, hello Garangom, you're looking like a big lad at the moment. No offense obviously. Just a uh, sizable boy armor through this to get our buff. Oh, that's not what I meant to do, but we got it now. It's not the worst thing in the world, doing extra damage. Ooh, adrenaline rush. Okay, okay. Now, the main part of this build is I want to try and land as many of these uh, ending slaps as we can, because they will do most damage. My nose is itchy, that's why I didn't punish any of that. Ow, really? Okay. Get some slaps going. Gonna try my best to commentate this. I usually am not the greatest with gun lance. I don't really feel all too much like carding. It's manual reload to get our erupting fire back if we run out. Because uh, I think that'll be the, the biggest damage increase for us is keeping erupting cannon up. Because uh, it does a lot of damage. I think it's like, um, uh, like an offensive guard in terms of how much damage it gives, right? Could be wrong though. Oh, we got it active, that's good. Get the slap down. As I said, that's our, our best source of damage. So as long as we can get at least that going, um, we should be good on damage, I think. He's also not giving us Anomaly Blight, which is a bit rough. It's manual reload. As I said, I want to keep it up to date if I can. Okay. Nice, we got a slap. Get another evade. I probably could have put Adrenaline Rush on here to be honest, or uh, more of it at least. But uh, didn't seem like we had the space. Okay, get that into that. We're hitting a terrible hit zone for this honestly, this is uh, real bad. But at least we got the damage in. So, uh, doing that, we'll just armor through it. We don't want to waste our Intrepid Heart on that if we can. Oh, okay, that's how you lead into that. Good, good, good. I knew it did somehow, but I didn't know exactly how to do the combo. Oh, we got a stagger. 700 powder mantle. Dodge through that. Ah, oh, it was intrepid heart. That's okay though, that's why we have it. Just go through this. Activate our buff again, I think. Nice. Reload. Dodge through it. Okay, okay. Get the slap. Ugh, get the slap. Also, I watched the uh, Mario movie today. It was pretty good. Definitely uh, recommend it. It was fun time, at least. Uh, okay, yep, he's doing this. We can just get away here, because he should... Oh, he didn't. Alright, I thought he might do the slam down the boulder. Okay. Block. <clears throat> get the hits in. Again, try and make sure we get to our big damage as often as possible. No, oh, I want to do this into this. There we go. Get our erupting fire back. Reverse dash through it. Okay. Okay, okay. Also found with um, gun lance. I don't know if this is for old gun lances, but the like lunging forward one is such a bad attack. <laughs> It comes out so slow, and it does less damage than your regular poke, which is weird. Oh, I tried to reverse dash it. Okay, we got the big slap. Get under him. Just gonna reload, since he can't really hit us. Reverse dash over to him. Reload again. 
Okay. Do that terrible attack just to get some distance. So it appears we need some more uh, handcraft. I thought this build would have enough sharpness to last the zone because we're pretty much at the five minutes. But uh, I guess not. No, that was a bit weird. But it's fine. God, it takes so long out of that attack to do anything. There we go. What? That was so weird. I don't know what happened there. Let's get our buff back. Is he gonna pop? No? Let's armor through it. I knew it! Just back it up. Block this. Get back on him. I don't know why he hasn't left. I think that's why we're actually uh, bad on sharpness here. Yeah, he should have left um, like a minute ago or so. So I think our sharpness is actually fine. He just uh, refused to leave there, which is unfortunate. I think we did too much damage. At least I I hope we do did too much damage and that's why. God, it comes out so slow. Now I wanted to play some Slaplance because uh, I went on the um, like Reddit, like meta Reddit to see what kind of Slaplance sets there are and if I can get any references for it. Literally there is not a single mention of Slaplance at all. It's just like uh, shelling based stuff, which is cool I guess. It is the appeal to Gunlance for a lot of people. But it's fun to just throw it back to something like this. Even though I'm getting clapped up. But we should be able to heal pretty... Oh, it missed. I was going to say, we should be able to heal pretty well there, but... I missed the hits, obviously. Nice. Okay, we're stacking him. We're just trading blows at this point. And I'm doing enough damage with our slaps to... Keep up, at least. Okay. Oh, okay, so I can get out of that attack pretty quick. Like the back slam there. So maybe that's where I usually stop the combo? Yeah, I think that's what we should be doing here. Is doing the um, downward one, not the side. Because the side one is too slow. If we don't have enough time, we're just going to get hit every time. Also, haven't been keeping up Erupting Fire at all. Should definitely do that. Blast dash over to him. Get good positioning. Oh, that's unfortunate. I don't know why I cancelled that so early. We definitely didn't have to, but that's okay. Got a uh, armor through this. Is there a way to not do erupting fire out of that? Because we don't have the the thing ready most of the time. I'm not sure. There probably is. Oh, adrenaline rush. Clean. Okay, just give him some slaps. Reverse dash through it. Do the terrible attack again, just to just to get over to him. Okay. It feels like the build's doing damage when I'm actually hitting good hit zones. Kind of, and then I do a hundred... <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know what the heck is going on. feel like it should be doing quite a bit more for the amount of skills we put into this. Oh, he's doing the follow-up. Okay. Get some slaps. What's he doing? Get an erupting fire back as well. There we go. Get that buff. Quick reload. Okay. Ooh, nice. Go after him. Stag at him. Nice. Just stay under him. Get those slaps in. Reset it. Do some more. Think we get hit there. Ooh, just in time. Yeah, I think that's going to be like one of the hardest habits to break is doing a uh, full combo there instead of ending it early because uh, that's definitely costing us quite a bit of damage armor through this we don't need to waste it on that attack oh okay I can uh, do a, a shell there to cancel it excellent that's good knowledge knowledge oh go Megala my man it's going ham and I did the wrong input. <laughs> That's going to be a real hard habit to break. Okay. Get the slaps. Maybe if I start with the poke, I'll be more consistent with the uh, attacks we should be doing. Like that. 
Ah, dang. Straight into a trap. Poor lad. Okay, that was some good damage. Smack on the head. Okay, okay. Oh, damn it. I pressed the wrong trigger. And we don't have a heal. Okay, we good, we good. Hanoa healed us. And we got a healing bat now. What else healed me? That was weird. I got like a dust there and then something else big healed me. Okay. Just stay on the ground. We do have emboldened, so we get quite a bit of, uh, of goodies. Okay, get into the slap. Back into the slap again. Do some more of it. He loves it. Okay. Staggered him. Oops. Yeah, uh, as you can see, I think erupting fire is quite an important thing. And I literally have not kept it up at all. Ah. Is that how it's always been for Gunlance? When you, like, step forward, it, like, hold forward on the inputs? Does it do that annoying attack that doesn't do a whole lot? Because, uh, that's, that's rough, to say the least. And, yeah, that, doing that sweep has gotten me hit so many times as I do it again. Jesus. Damn it. <laughs> Keep wasting that because we don't have the the Wyvern fire ready. Okay, get the slaps. He's close to dead, so... Would think he's going to die here soon. Dodge to the side. Okay. Slap him. Nice powder mantle there. Okay. Ah, oh, it was one hit. That wasn't too bad time, to be honest. I think this could work. But, uh, I, I don't know why it was doing so much damage sometimes, and then sometimes it was just tickling him. I'm not sure. I definitely need to work on Erupting Fire as well. And I had my Intrepid for a while there. So we could have gotten in a few more wide sweeps, I think. Well, everybody, that was making and trying out a Slaplands build. I think Slaplands could be okay in this. Um, we just need to get a lot more damage into it and find a way to properly play it. As well as what makes some of those hits chunky, because it was so weird. Sometimes we did a lot of damage, sometimes we did nothing. But as always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you on the next one.